Let me immediately welcome Auntie Joy to the microphone to deliver a welcome to country. Can I particularly welcome Warwick and uh, say what a pleasure and an honour it is to have you here um, on country and uh, always know that you're welcome here and uh, we'll support you in whatever way we can because we're very proud not only of you but uh, the work that you've done and uh, continuing uh, to do great things but also that expression of Aboriginal culture and heritage. It's not only the journey that we take, it's how we travel and um, if we're proud of who we are, um, we are of course, but it makes us deeply proud to be able to express who we are and deeply proud to show that um, the spirits of our ancestors have certainly laid a way for us. I have five ideas a day and you know, if, if they were all going to turn into feature films, well, you know, it would be like 50 years down the track I could actually create them. But with, with video, with um, installation, with photography and that sort of stuff, I can do it instantly. So it's been really beautiful through Stranded and now Mother Courage and I'm really proud of this. I, t I talked to Mother Courage this morning and she was very, very, very excited about the idea of being in a nice warm room <clears throat> rather than a sleeting, snowing uh, Germany where she just came from. Mother Courage is the latest commission of contemporary moving image works that ACMA has produced and its immense commitment we made two or three years ago to the creation and exhibition of new artworks by Australian and international artists. The work when you see it is quite stunning, it's multi-layered. It's a real beautiful work of art in there you will see in a minute. Is this a figure who is lost and lonely? Or is it a strong, self-determining woman? Is this person a victim? Or is she in charge? In the sense of loss that is there, what value the sustainability and the existence that she creates? There are certainly questions in the work, the remarkable work that you're about to see. When you look at that little boy who is playing the air guitar, there is surely a bit of Warwick in him and I'm delighted to declare the installation open.